Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel, my name is Sarah. In today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys my top 10 favorite nude lipsticks on my skin tone, but they're all gonna be from one brand, and can you guys guess what my, what brand it's gonna be from? I'll give you a minute. It's ColourPop. <laughs> so I have uh, lipsticks in a few different versions of their formulas, but I figured I'd do a try-on version and uh, we'll see if you guys like it. If you want to see my top favorite <laughs> ColourPop nude lipsticks on my skin tone, then uh, keep on watching. So before we get into any of the lip shades, the most important thing for me for nude lipsticks is having a good lip liner. The three lip liners that I use the most when it comes to um, liquid lipsticks, BFF3, BFF4, which is a new favorite of mine, and my all-time favorite lip liner, and this is my lip, my favorite lip liner of all time, regardless of the brand, the lip color that I'm gonna wear, unless it's red, I never use brown red. Actually, that's not true either. Anyways, my favorite lip liner of all time is the K lip liner, and this was part of the collaboration that ColourPop did with Karuchi, and I'm not sure if it's available anymore, but if it is, I will have it linked down below. If it's not available, BFF3 is always an amazing option, and then BFF4 if you need something a little bit darker. So to start off, I'm gonna go with one of my newer favorite nude lips, which is what's already on my lips today, and then is the shade Punch Bowl. Now, in the packaging, you know, it doesn't really look nude. I mean, but on my lips, it's pretty nude. And remember, I have my lip liner on. So I'm gonna show you my other favorites. And since I started with Ultra Matte, we'll just keep it with the Ultra Matte. I don't even know if I wanna talk about this one because it's discontinued, but this is literally my favorite nude lipstick of all time. Of all time. This is the shade Buffy. This is like literally the perfect shade for me though. I mean, so this is literally my perfect nude. Now, like I said, that one is discontinued. So if I'm not mistaken, Fuego is the new version of this, but also Fuego is one of my faves. It's part of the new formulation project again, but it's a very close shade. It's a lot darker, but. So last but not least, this is the Ultra Matte Lip in the shade K. This is a great brown. It's a little on the red side, but you know, I think it's really good. And I love the way it complements my skin tone. Yeah, great shade. I feel like this deserved a shout out, even though it's not nude on me exactly. I would still use this as a nude and just put a lighter color in the center to brighten it up a little bit. It's basically like wearing my lip liner all over my lips. So that is it for the ultra matte lips. Now let's move on to the ultra satin formulas. So I have four favorite nudes in the ultra satin lip formula. The first one is Strip. I'll go ahead and show that to you guys. Now I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna swatch the rest of these without a lip liner just so you guys can see what it is. But just know that when I wear this shade, I usually wear a lip liner. Next, we have the Shayla collaboration, and this is the satin lip again in the shade Slow Down. But I feel like Slow Down is the satin lip equivalent of the shade Buffy. Now Buffy again no longer exists, and it's it was a an ultra matte lip, but. Now the next two shades I feel are very, very, very similar to each other. They're both uh, collaborations. One is with I Love Sarai here on YouTube, and the other is with Becky G, who is a musical artist. <laughs> So I'm gonna first try on the shade Miha, which is that collaboration with Becky G. So this one's more just pink, but when I wear it with mine, actually I'm just gonna show you what it looks like with the lip liner. So you can kind of get a vibe. 
and I just used BFF4. It's a beautiful pink nude, but again, definitely one of my faves. Lastly, for the satin lips, this is the shade 951, and this is the I Love Sari collab. It's definitely like one of those true nudes for me. In my opinion, this is one of those more neutral colored nudes. It's not too fleshy colored, not too peach, not too pink, not too brown, but it's somewhere in the middle of all of it, but with a very neutral undertone. It's not cool, to not too cool tone, but just, just a little bit, just a little bit. And this one is a perfect one for my skin tone because I don't even need a lip liner. I can literally wear it like this and it looks good. Looks great. My all-time favorite Luxe Lip nude is the Kathleen Lights collaboration, and this is in the shade What's Your Sign. And I feel like all these shades are so similar, but they are because they're my nudes. Anyways, so next up we have Pinkies Up. This is an amazing shade, honestly. It's a pinky nude, but a nude. Next up we have Uno Mas. Oh my gosh, let's let's ignore my lip line with this one. <laughs> my lips are still a little slippery from that makeup wipe. <laughs> Next up we have the shade Third Eye. Now this shade is very similar to What's Your Sign? So there are two Velvet Blurs Luxe lipsticks that are my favorite nude shades. And first one is going to be the CA Love or California Love. Did the other lipsticks smell like this? This smells like vanilla or cupcakes or something. Okay, now the Velvet Blur, the formula of these lipsticks over the cream, I mean the cream ones you can just keep applying and applying and I, I feel like I can apply it for days and nothing bad will ever happen to my lips, but the velvet ones, they literally feel like nothing. Like nothing. Like these ones are amazing and they smell so good. So this is the shade CA Love. California Love? Whichever. Last but not least, we have the shade Creme Fresh. Thank you guys for watching this video. Um, give me, don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you guys like what you saw and subscribe to my channel somewhere down there. <laughs> and hit the notification bell so that you guys can get actual notifications for when I upload um, but just in case you don't know I do upload Tuesdays and Fridays so I can't wait to see you guys in my next upload and thank you so much for watching bye <laughs> oh look my makeup looks kind of cute hey girl hey oh my god did I have a little buddy dare the whole time you didn't even say anything to me guys here <laughs> oh my god I didn't even record it damn it <laughs> So let's re-record. Can't believe I just took that off and didn't record the whole thing. Damn it, I broke that one too. Closing time, one last call for alcohol. So finish your whiskey or beer. I know who, okay anyways.